Well, Crossrock concerns in Costa Mesa where residents want the city to add one on a very busy street in front of a park. They say without it, it's dangerous to cross. KCAL News reporter Michelle Geely shows us what one person recently did to send a message to city officials. Somebody had painted a crosswalk there and it was actually kind of nice. From a distance, the white line stretching across Wilson Street resembled a real crosswalk. People in the densely populated Costa Mesa neighborhood who wait and wait and wait to get to the other side of the busy road were absolutely happy about it. And I just thought it was hilarious when somebody spray painted one in. <laughs> Residents say it made its mark. Finally, they were able to get to the other side of Wilson Street quicker. The park across the street is a favorite spot for pets in the area. Pedestrians complain that it can take several minutes, depending on the time of day, to make it safely through the traffic. When you were in the middle of the street, cars actually stopped so you could get across the street. Now it's gone and we're having those issues again, trying to get across the street. The asphalt graffiti was far from amusing to those who engineer the roads. 20,000 cars pass through this intersection every day, many going 30 to 35 miles an hour. For the safety of everyone, Costa Mesa Mayor John Stevens says city workers painted over the unsanctioned crosswalk as soon as they heard about it. So they might think, well, they have the right of way, so it's safe, and they go and people don't see them, and they don't see the crosswalk, and a motorist might hit them. The added control is this hawk signal, which we have in other places in the city. The mayor says this is what's coming to Wilson Street. The traffic term is a hawk signal, high intensity activated crosswalk signal. The idea is when the button is pushed, the red lights flash, hopefully getting drivers' attention. A Wilson Street improvement project is in the works, but the crosswalk is still at a minimum four months away as city crews wait for signal equipment to arrive. In Costa Mesa, Michelle Geely, KCAL News.